Welcome. I am Lucas. I would like to take this time to explain something I consider quite vital. Most people who see me, if not a fellow atheist, would likely assume I am here to attack believers. Although, it may appear this way, it is untrue. In many cases, I have a great respect for someone who truly believes in something, and lives a humble life supporting it. I know there are good, loving believers out there. There are women and men who sacrifice their time, money, and food to support their beliefs and to care for those less fortunate. These people, I have little problem with. In fact, they are the reason I make my videos. These people, good people, are being lied to, and I refuse to tolerate it. The liars are the priests, the pastors, the cardinals, and the heads of the Vatican. They enslave good people without their knowledge. I have known good preachers before. Preachers that truly believe in their gods, and would give their last dollar to feed a starving man. This, however, is not always the case. The fact is, unless you live within a few miles of these good preachers, you will never have heard their names. The ones you do hear of, the ones on the television, or radio, the ones in the big cathedrals making decisions with the money from their parishioners. They are liars, and cheats. There is a very well-known man who attacks science. I will not invoke a lawsuit by saying his name. He has the eye of many people who believe him because he is a former star. He says that evolution is fake because no one has ever discovered a transitional species. He is wrong, and he knows it. In fact, he is well aware. The animal he says will prove evolution to be true, could never exist naturally due to evolution. This species is meant to be idiotic sounding, and make evolution seem ridiculous. It is a blatant lie. A simple search over the internet can tell you this. Most things the creationists say about evolution is a lie, though most creationists do not even know it. They are just repeating what someone they trust once said, I am not a scientist. All I know about science, I have taught myself. I have learned a great deal about evolution, but not nearly as much as there is to know. It does not take a scholar to understand science. A few minutes of research can teach you some amazing things. Science will someday answer every question. Right now, of course, there is more to learn. But, the research must be done. Do not condemn science because it does not have all the answers. Our knowledge is growing on a daily basis, but assuming a higher power is the force behind something, rather than trying to find out what really is, does not help. Please, open a book. Do some research on the internet. Take a night course in something you might enjoy. Knowledge is the key to our future. Embrace it.